Hey my legion, how y'all doing today? I'm here today to review Happy Farms Mango Fire Cheddar Cheese. This is the cheddar cheese that has habanero peppers and mango flavor. It says sweet mango, hot habanero. And this was, uh, I believe, $3.49 at Aldi's. And this is one of the uh, brands made by Aldi's. It said Happy Farms Preferred Mango Fire Cheddar Cheese. Right there. And actually, uh, you know, I mentioned that Steve and Taylor and Kylie helped me out, you know, when we were there getting groceries and loading them up and stuff like that. Um, they were asking, they said that they can't wait to see my, me review this. So this is your guys' Easter present. How's that? Um, I'm just going to go ahead and cut off a block of this and give it a taste. And you see, like, the big things of uh, habanero in there, too. Big orange thing. Well, you'll probably see it as soon as I open it up better. Go ahead. Nope, they're not opening up too badly. Now I got plenty of uh, storage bags to put this in whenever, you know, to keep it in the refrigerator. Okay. Oh, wow, well, now you can really. Oh, wow. <coughs> Let's peel this off right here. Look at this. You can really see the habanero in this. This is going to be fortified with heat. Along with the sweet from the mango. I'm going to cut off a, just a chunk for the review. All right. Okay. Now you can put this in the storage bag and put it back in the fridge. Okay, let's go ahead and show you. Look at that. This is the cut section right there. You can see little bits of habanero sticking out. Let's give it a taste. Now, you right away, I mean, you get, I mean, cheese has that, you can smell cheese a little bit, but you can smell the mango, which is a little bit uh, weird, because I remember mango drink, it's like smelling a mango drink, kind of. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. Wow. First of all, you get the mango taste of mayo. Now you're getting the heat from habanero. These are really hot. I mean, when you're chewing it, you get the mango first, right? And then it took like a couple of seconds if you eat a hot pepper for it to kick in. Now it's really kicking. You can really feel a burn. Now these are, these have decent heat to them. They really do. Let me eat the whole slice on camera. I like this real well. Once again, you get the sweet from habanero, then you get that, when you're done, you get that kick from the, uh, and you get the sweetness from the mango. And taste it, then you get that kick from the habanero. Wow. Pinch it up. If any one of you are fans of hot flavored cheese, if you ever go to Aldi's, get this. It's burning. Mango fire. It really is burning. Now you can heal it, feel the heat coming up and up and up. Far harder than I expected. This is delicious. I give this a full on 10 out of 10. It what did not lie whatsoever. It is a fire. I mean, not like I still talk, but it's got a really good heat to it. I really like these really well. Like I said, I think it's a 349. It's not bad. This puts uh, Pepper Jack to shame. And I love Pepper Jack, though, but this really has the heat. I think my, I don't know if my dad was still alive. I don't know if he'd like this. Well, he'd definitely try it, and then he wouldn't want to try anymore, because the heat's building. It's not like uh, with a dairy product, like milk and stuff like that usually uh, cools down the mouth, you know, because like the, the stuff that makes it hot, the capsaicin, is like a glue that sticks to your tongue. And the milk, ho milk helps loosen it up and gets rid of that burn, but you would think it would get rid of it in dairy, but it does not. This is fantastic. 
if you like hot and spicy things, definitely go out and look for Mango Fire. I mean, it's not, if you're a real chili head, it's not going to melt your face off, but it has a good amount of heat that you'll be impressed. And a little bit of surprise. I love this real well. So that's your Easter present. Stephen, Kylie, and Taylor, I hope you like this video. And until next time, my mouth is burning, and take care of my legion.